Hello everyone, and uh, before the video starts, I just want to say thank you for the last video, and thank you for all the views it got. Definitely was not expecting uh, it to blow up as much as it did, so I just want to say thank you for that, and thank you for the likes as well. Really appreciate it, and be very appreciated on this video as well. And if you haven't, please subscribe, because I'm going to start posting um, at least probably twice a week probably more than that so yeah please subscribe and uh, like the video if you like it really helped me grow my channel and hope you enjoy the video hello everyone and welcome to another Crusader Kings 3 tutorial this one is going to be another short one but uh, a lot easier and uh, it's just straight up how to get mods um, it's extremely simple it's just like any other uh, Paradox games if you've ever had them before and all you gotta do is open up Crusader Kings 3 here and You can go to mods and Right here you'll see enhance your game experience with mods now you can go to browse mods and it will take you to Paradox um, Mod Website here and you can go here and you can download them But then you gotta go into the files and then you gotta do that but there's a lot simpler and easier way to do that. So close out of this and don't even worry about this. You can even close out of this. Go to Steam and open that up. And right here, it'd usually be on here. And you can go to Community Workshop. And um, just type in Crusader Kings in this little search thing. And boom, these mods will pop up. So you can go to any mod you want. I'm just gonna use Brighter Portraits as an example here. And all you gotta do is hit this green subscribe button right here. Click that, and it says subscribed. All you gotta do is close out Steam, open up Crusader Kings 3 again. And right in the mods, right there, Brighter Portraits. And if you go on the play, it will automatically be there. You don't have to enable it or anything. As long as it's enabled in that little start paradox launcher, you will automatically have it in game. So you can already see it looks like these are already brighter. Especially when you get into the game, it will of course be brighter. Right here, you can see I can tell you that it's way brighter than it used to be. And uh, of course you don't necessarily need that mod, that's just an aesthetic mod. There's tons of mods that you can get. Um, yeah, it's very simple, and that's all you gotta do. And thanks for watching. Hope you had a great day. See you in the next video.